The Midnight Library by Kazuno Kohara. Shh. Stop scratching. The Midnight Library. Once there was a library that opened only at night. <laughs> A little librarian worked there with her three assistant aisles. Every night, animals came to the library from all over town. All over the town. And the little librarian and her three little assistant aisles helped each other. Helped each and every one find a perfect book. Shh. The library was always busy, but it was always also a, a peaceful and quiet place until one night. Shh. Khaleesi. Bang, crash, toot. A band of squirrels began to play music. Shh, said the little librarian. Shh. Please be quiet in the reading room. You girls. We're sorry, said the squirrels, but we're trying to find a good song for our concert. Then follow me, said the li little librarian. She showed the squirrels to the activity room. Shh. Silence settled upon the library once, once more while the band played their instruments as loud as they liked. Later that night, the little librarian was busy putting the books away when suddenly it started to rain. <coughs> oh dear, said the little librarian. There must be a hole in the roof. But sitting on top of a bookshelf, she found a wolf. And she was crying so much her tears fell her tears fell like rain. What is the matter, Miss Wolf? asked the little librarian. Something very sad happened in my story, and I can't read it anymore, replied the wolf. Please don't cry, said the little librarian, and she took Miss Wolf to the storytelling corner. They read the book together until gradually the the wolf began to smile. The librarian and her assistants knew the story and had the story had a very happy ending. Ding ding! The bell rang out as the sun came up. It was time for everyone to go home. One by one, the animals left at the midnight library. Left the midnight library, all except one new visitor. A tortoise, reading slowly in a corner, and he would not move. I must stay until I finish reading this book, said the tortoise. I only have 500 pages left. Let us make you, make you a library card, said the little librarian. Then you can borrow this book and take it home with you. How wonderful, said the tortoise, and how lucky I am. Goodbye, Mr. Tortoise. Have a good day. The three owls and the little librarian gave the empty library a good dust and a sweep. Then finally it was time to find one last book, a very special book. A book of bedtime stories for three sleepy owls. Sleep tight. The Midnight Library by Kazuno Kohara. <laughs>